Welcome to my channel, Rue Collection. With you, as usual, Mr. Tim. Today, I want to make a video about grammar, as usual. I know it's boring, but anyway, today's video will be a little bit different from others. Okay, today I want to take interview from some guys, and I want to know about their opinion about grammar. Okay, hello, Derek. How's it going? You know, I have one question. You know, I'm curious about uh, knowing that your opinion. What right. do you think about grammar? Uh, it is useful to learn, or we have to know this. I mean, uh, learning English naturally. What if you are not English speaker, yes. Then I guess the grammar will be just a foundation of your English, of your speech, specifically your speaking. Uh, you know, without grammar, it's just a skeleton of people. We have no physiology. Well, it won't be programmed enough. So my only advice is learn English first. Begin it from scratch with our grammar, and then you can manage how to do grammar well. And after learning some of the basic principles of English or speaking, and then you can get some grammar courses. Oh, I also okay. did the same stuff uh -huh. when I was learning. Thank you, man. Okay, thank you. We'll yeah. see you. Crap. Hello, Mr. Steve. Hello. Oh, you know, I just want to know about one really interesting thing, you know, a lot of people argue about this. What do you think about learning grammar? Should we learn grammar in order to be like a, in order to be like a good speaker? Okay, or not? Uh, do you know about no. A.G. Hawk? Sure, the sure, sure. Of the, the best teacher of the world uh, from English and teaching English. Uh, as he said, Without grammar, we can learn the English by through the listening, reading, and the speaking and talking with the people in a good way, in a proper way, and too much also. But uh, when it comes to me, from my point of view, it's the first type of the learning the grammar when it comes to the local people who are not native speakers. I mean, you know, uh, well, without grammar, we can speak uh, through the, you know, learning the by heart, uh, some phrases, some uh, sentences. But if we know the grammar, it's useful for us um, to speak uh, just from our point of view. I mean, that's all. Thank you, man. Okay. Hello, Mr. Honda. Hey, so how are you doing? Uh, I'm great. Uh, I have one question for you. All right. And what do you think about, uh, you know, a lot of people like, argue with each other that yes. grammar is not really important. Yes. Uh, you know, to learn some kind of language. I mean, some particular language. Yes, specifically what, English. Uh, yeah. What do you think about this? Some of guys are taking exam without like preparing about grammar. Yes. But anyway, they took IELTS and uh, mm -hmm. they have high score. What do you sure. think about this? Well, first of all, you know, people are different and their potentials are also different. For example, some people can learn any foreign language without learning the grammar stuff of that language. On the flip side, other people can learn uh, language but not without grammar. So depending on your potentials and your abilities, skills, so you're supposed to like define or like, you know, identify your potential. For example, personally me, I have never learned grammar, first of all. Uh, when I was willing to learn English, specifically it's spoken English. So if you really want to master any foreign language, especially English, so my advice would be definitely to learn at least uh, rudimentary, like basic grammar, mm -hmm. not the whole grammar stuff. Yeah. Yes, just basic stuff is uh, definitely enough to learn the language. Okay. So when it comes to taking IELTS, so I would say yeah, you have to learn grammar a little bit, just not to have mistakes in your speech to avoid those blunders, so that you can have a good chance to score higher in the speaking test of IELTS. But not completely, you have to supposed to learn. Mm. But if your aim is getting like about 8.5 or 8.0 in the speaking test, in this case, I would with confidence say is that you have to learn yeah. grammar, you have to master grammar. Yeah, that's not fully right? Yes, sure, just if your aim is getting over 8 or 8.5. Yes. Yeah, okay. It's your like, destiny or your choice of getting a high score in a speaking test, yes. Okay, thank you. No problem. Okay. Bye-bye. Thank you guys for watching my video. See you.